Howdy do, Buckaroos. Hey, I am at Brick Street Brews in downtown Rogers, Arkansas, and I'm having the core Barney's Imperial Red IPA. $7 for a 12-ounce pour. They pour it to the snifter here. Uh, it's 9.5%, 114 IBUs. It's a big one. I've actually had this once before, but it's been about three years since I had it. I had it at the at the, the Springdale Brewery about three years ago, but it's been a while. But I saw it on the menu here, and I thought I'd give her a whirl. The aromas are nice on it. You get these big, multi-red aromas. Uh, maybe just a touch of... of I mean, just the slightest hint of brown sugar sweetness, but then you got a lot of big hops coming at you, a lot of big citrus, some herbal hops as well. Oh, it's nice. Yeah, it's nice. It's very nice. Oh, I remember I loved it at the time, too. I am a fan of the hoppy red, and I'll tell you why, especially the imperial hoppy red. It's because I think probably, I don't know, maybe 10, 15 years ago, this would probably just be considered an imperial IPA. But Imperial IPAs have gotten so like bodied now that you know, I mean, you almost had to tag red on this because I mean, most of them were this color, you know, 10 to 15 years ago. It's kind of a nice amber, slightly ruby hue to it. But there's some malt in there, and that's the point I was trying to make. It's got some body, it's got something for all those hops to hold on to. I think that's why I am such a huge fan of the style because it gives me. It gives me everything I want. It gives me a big beer, big and bold on, on, on all fronts. On the aroma, on the malt, on the hops, it's just big in all directions. It's a lot of big toasted malt. Maybe just the slightest, I mean the very slightest in a caramel on the malt. Give it maybe just, just again, just the slightest bit of, of brown sugar sweetness. giving way to, to big citrus or certainly some grapefruit going on and there's some herbal hops going on and it's a little peppery in the finish as well as it, as it kind of cleans up at the end but it's one of those that's just big in all directions so I'm not going to run this long so I'm not going to drink a 9.5% beer for right past I want to sit and enjoy it I thought I'd give you all a glimpse of it here from Brick Street Brews for Barney's Imperial Ring. Nine and a half, 114 IBUs this time. Beer Whisper. We'll talk to you later.